Merry Christmas and Happy Holidays. I'm Georgianne Luce here with Midlife Matters here at WPAA TV. Christmas is a time for all of us to reflect and to get into the spirit of giving. And one present I would like to give to you is uh, the joy of a book that I received from a friend just maybe five years ago, so as an adult, which is called Auntie Claus and the Key to Christmas, and it's by Elise Primavera. And there's a whole series of these books, and I'll just take you through the story a little bit because it brought me some joy, and hopefully it will to you as well. So Auntie Claus takes place in New York City in modern times, and she is quite the fashion lady. And as it turns out, she's the older sister of Chris Kringle. The family's name is Kringle. And let me tell you just a little bit about the intro. Darlings, the story you're about to be told is absolutely true. It happened one Christmas when my nephew Christopher began to have doubts, shall we say. The entire family was in a frightful uproar and very cross. Well, we couldn't have that. So we go on to the journey of Christopher, who's having doubts about the magic of Christmas, the existence of Santa Claus, and his trials and tribulations as he went through some of the dark side of, um, I would say, non-believing. And all ends well. And Auntie Claus talks about, as you can see, everything turned out just fine. And recently I asked Christopher, do you remember the year you learned about our little family secret? He chuckled and said, yes, I do, but that was when I received the best Christmas gift ever. To believe is the key, the key to Christmas. Yes, the key, darlings, the one that can't be seen, but then all the best things are invisible. Love and Mary Kringle from Auntie Claus. And one of Auntie Claus's other mottos is that it is better to give than receive. So I hope we all enter the spirit with a great sense of giving and hope you enjoyed this little story and looking forward to a prosperous and happy 2015. Thanks very much. George Ann Lucier with Midlife Matters.